De La Wright, my envies, welcome. Foolishness, they say, is swearing in the name of one God while you are at the shrine of another. It is not a small something, no. We are hearing a report right now that is making the rounds on social media that all oh God, the, oh, the almighty um, Oba Akandesa doctor has been suspended from the Council of Obas. Yes, so that so many Obas came out in support of the Oni of Ife, saying that his own is too much. Now, um, the thing is that when the protective charm, you know, got missing from the palace, they said that only a few fair, you know, had an inclination as to where this was coming from. But he hardly knew that it was um, um, Oba Akinde. He suspected some people uh, who are on that same sect of Oba Akinde, um, uh, Oba um, uh, Akinde, but he never ever could have thought that it was Oba Akande because Oba was right there in um, 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 London and he was undergoing some kind of treatment. And only of Ife could never have imagined in his widest imagination that this man will be doing this all from there. Now, they said that he was the one who was working with others who are here to gather protective charm from um, the Oni of Ife. And now a lot of confession has come out as to why they took the protective charm uh, from the Oni of Ife. And a lot of people are saying, if Blow Blow is involved, as you know, if all the information we have been hearing is the truth and Blow Blow is involved, why is Oni of Ife still keeping Blow Blow close to him? That is a question everybody is asking. But they said that this thing with the wives are so political and that um, the Lafogiri house, that they have made it so, so, so political that if that woman goes, there might be a whole lot of problems, that there are so many things that people do not know and that uh, uh, do, they don't want people to know about the kind of promises and all the stuff that went on. That's why KBSC is still um, keeping that woman. That is if this information that we are hearing is the truth, knowing that I do not live in the palace of the Oni of Ife, neither am I related to them or related to anyone who is related to the Oni of Ife. I'm just a blogger. Whatever I get on social media, I bring it right here. Now, um, from what we are hearing, they are saying that um, um, this man has been working um, uh, against the only right from UK and there are some of them who are here and as God will have it, you know that there was a time that uh, some men were uh, uh, suspended from the um, 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 uh, Council of Chiefs. They said those ones were part of the ones who were working with um Oba Akande right there. Um, and so um, they suspended them. They said there were three. But right now they said there's still one that is remaining that has not been suspended. Even though she, he is acting as though he's not with them. He has no hand in what is going on with them and all of that. But they said um, a lot of people do know that, yes, so he has a hand and he is indeed uh, with them. So right now, Oba Akande, who is the almighty Oba, that has um, a thing he has, they say he is even a member of the uh, kingmakers and all of that, knowing that he is uh, uh, responsible for what happened and uh, how that uh, uh, protective charm left the palace of the Oni of Ife, they say he has been suspended. Meanwhile, they, you know that they said they arrested him right there in the police um, custody. They said he had the air tree, the, uh, the, 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 the gods to um, be calling on they need who happens to be blow blow to come so they can have a discussion. But unfortunately for him, they said blow blow refused to go and blow blow rejected him. Blow blow said he ha she has absolutely nothing to do with this oba. Now, um, uh, as information is um, going around on social media, they said when the only of affair was installed, okay, um, uh. You know, uh, so many princes came out. Like in, they said, a lot of princes, they have 47 princes who came out from all the five ruling houses, okay? A lot of them came out from Lafogidi House. They said this, Akande, they said he came out and his sons, they came out, all of them, okay? But he thought that it was going to go back to them. And when it did not get back to them, that the man could not believe it. The man eh, was ready to buy somebody because of that thing. But as God will have it, God, 
them help in Uni. And now they now said uh, for the uh, uh, rulership to be okay, they will have to marry a Bini blood from the royal family so they can run the race together. They now married Wurola. Wurola, it did not work. Wurola left. So, meanwhile, they said at that time, La Fugidi, they, they had said that they will uh, marry, that they would they will uh, succumb so that they will marry their daughter. But Oni did not want, at that time, Oni, of course, was um, younger than now. He was still flexing his uh, muzzle, nothing will happen, nothing will happen. And uh, he didn't marry. Then when Urola left, uh, it took some time. Then Oni went to go and bring Queen Naomi. When they brought Queen Naomi, they said all hell was let loose. Hey! Hey, why will he go and marry a Christian? Why will he go and bring a Christian? Why will he go and bring somebody who knows nothing about tradition? Why will he do this? Why will he do that? Why will it even be this girl and all of that? They, at, the, at that point, a lot of people didn't know why they were fighting so hard. They were fighting because they, when Oni of Ife made um, the first proposition that I wanted to bring this lady, Naomi, into the palace, they thought that a uh, prophetess, she was one of these fake prophetess. You know that there are a lot of fake uh, prophets and prophetess, those ones that uh, nothing holds water in them. But when the girl stepped into the palace, the moment she stepped into the palace, they know that this one has got some essence and, you know, um, um, uh, this one is thick in what she believes in. Then that was when they found out that they have done the biggest mistake by bringing her in because of her prayer life. They said her prayer life was so tr troubling. Like they, her prayer life kept troubling them so much. A lot of things were happening in the palace. People were getting sick. Some were getting healed. As they would pray, they had this prayer uh, 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 Wednesday in the palace of the only of the first um, palace where they would pray. Some people would get healed. Some, it's some, of, it's some people who would not want to confess and they will be sick and there were a lot of things happening. Some of the um, chiefs who were coming to the palace, they had issues because um, the atmosphere was no longer, you know, enabling again. Like they, they couldn't strive in that atmosphere again. At night there was problem because this lady was always praying. That was what happened. They said this Akande was one of those who fought so hard to make sure that woman left the palace. She, he fought so hard to make sure that woman left the palace. And they said that because he kept fighting physically and spiritually, they said that was how he became um, sick. As it is alleged, if this information is true, he became sick. Oh, serious sickness that almost took his life. They took him to from one place to the other, churches and all of that. They took him to London. When he came back, instead of him to come back and mind his business, he came back and started again. And that see where they till landed him. And they said he has been suspended from the Council of um, Chiefs. I'm going to bring you more update. I appreciate you so much. Thank you.